Hey everybody, welcome into Rock Painting 101 where we give you fun new rock painting ideas that anybody can create. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you do, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get painting. So this is a really easy base coat that you can do. You're going to take three different colors and just start spiraling them on your rock. Uh, let the coats dry slightly in between each one. I'm starting with yellow first, then I'm going to come in with my pink. These are the extra fine tip paint pens so that you get these nice fine lines. Make sure you doodle off your tip in between because you will get a little mixture of color um, on these first few layers. I'm not uh, letting them dry completely just so I get some variation, some oranges and things. Uh, the third color coming in, you want to be careful not to let it get too muddy. Uh, doodle off the tip so that you keep getting back to your original color and maybe go a little slower um, and don't press nearly as hard with the third color. So I'm just spiraling around. I'm going to doodle off the tip and then I'm letting this dry a little bit in between and then being a little more specific coming back through with my first two colors again. So I'm really going in with my pink and making very specific lines to fill in any gaps and then I'll come in one final time again here with my yellow and make sure that I keep uh, off of the wet paint that way I get nice yellow stripes in here so they're not all orange or all green uh, for our base coat then let this dry completely and we're going to come back and add on our word on this one we're going to do the word hope start by placing your letters down on your rock basic hand lining style then we're going to add some swoops and thicknesses now your downward strokes are where um, you can start by making your lines a little bit thicker i'm using the 1mr i couldn't find my 1m when i started this any extra fine tip or even um, the white gel pen I've used in the past too to do your letters. Now we're going to connect our letters together as well. Um, with the P, I, I have hand lettering sheets and they like to go down and then back up. So uh, we are going to do that. And then the left side of our E, we're gonna thicken a little bit too. And I like to kind of give it a little bit of a tail at the end. Um, I'm going to go back and thicken the left side of the letter P here as well. So just place this down. I'm going to let this layer of paint dry and come back and add a second coat um, as well. And I like to add some dots. These are optional, obviously. I'm also going to give this um, a little bit of an edge. I'm just doing little strokes and dots. Um, along the outside edge with my white. There is no rhyme or reason to this. I'm just kind of placing them down. I'm going to go around the rock a couple of times just so there again is an edge to your design. I'm not really overthinking this. Just a couple dots, a couple swoops here and there until you're happy with the outer edge. I did end up finding my 1M white. So when you're doing a second layer of white, make sure your paint pen is flowing well and you wanna make sure you're laying the paint on top. Don't press down really hard. I hope you enjoyed this quick word rock. We've got a few others that we're sharing as well. So follow along for more.